Are you trying to enhance your metaverse experience? Are you trying to reward your community? Then this video is for you. Hello everyone, my name is Creative and welcome to my new YouTube channel. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to create your spatial badges and walking you through the steps of how to connect your badges to your spatial Unity environments. Let's begin. All right, let's begin. The first thing we need to do is log into spatial.io. We wanna select our icon at the top and we want to navigate to our studio. Once we're in our studio, we want to head into our worlds. At the top, you will see a navigation of icon, badges, currency, spaces, and settings. We want to select is badges. As you can see, I've already created some badges previously in the past, but what we're gonna do for this exercise is create a new badge. The way that we do that is we select the new badge button at the top right. A Couple things that we need to add is a thumbnail, a name, and a description. For this thumbnail, there are some requirements. It does need to be a PNG file, a ratio, and if you need some motivation, Spatial does provide some templates for you to follow or for you to use. What I did, I used AI and I used Mid Journey to make my badge. I think these look sweet, so we're gonna be using these. I'm gonna head back over to our studio. I'm gonna hit upload, select our badge. I'm gonna give our badge a name. So I'm gonna call it Metaverse Trailblazer. In here, we can put a description of what we want to put for the badge. At the, at the end, you guys could always go back and change this, so keep that in mind. And what we're gonna do is select Create Badge. Now, the badge has been created successfully. Keep in mind, this is gonna be very important, the ID, so make sure you guys keep this browser or just copy that. So this is gonna be the first part. Next, we're gonna head over to our spatial environment. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you the quest. So what we do in spatial, or what's happening in spatial is that we are creating quests and then when a, a user completes the quest, we usually reward them with a badge. And what I'm gonna show you is the quest that I've already set up um, that doesn't have a badge and then we're going to go into unity and i'm going to show you how to connect the badge into unity and then we're going to run this demo again for you guys to see how it looks like before and after so logging into our sandbox environment at the bottom left the quest has already started when you come in the first thing we need to do is collect two coins so we're just going to walk straight and collect these so here's the first coin that we have the next one is we need to climb this wall perfect and then the last part of this quest is we need to go through this portal so when we go through this portal this is going to end the end the quest um, but there's no badge going to be tied to it so i'm going to show you how this looks like you can see that it says congrats you've earned a badge but there's no badge nothing has been displayed yet so i'm going to show you how that looks like in unity now we are inside unity and what we need to do is that we need to connect this quest to our badge. So all we need to do is select our quest. And if you don't know how to create a quest, you can just hit right click, hit spatial and just hit quest. I've already have this quest already hooked up. You guys saw the process of collecting the coins and collecting through the portal. But for us to collect our badges, very simple. What we need to do is go to quest, hit under quest, hit the plus button and we need here's the badge so there's two items there's two options you can ch choose from one is badge and the other one is items and items are going to be something that we're going to do in a later video when we talk about currencies or adding items to your uh, backpack so for right now we're just going to be doing badge and you guys remember the id that we talked about earlier so let's bring uh that one back up so under here we're going to copy this and we're gonna head back into our sandbox. We're gonna hit Control V. All right, so now when the quest is completed, you're gonna be rewarded a badge. Now you can add multiple badges and you can add multiple items when people complete tasks or complete quests, whatever you want. But for this exercise, we're just gonna be doing one badge. So we're gonna test this out. I'm gonna do test scene and then we're gonna rerun our sandbox one more time. All right, our sandbox environment is loading up. 
our quest has already started. So this time when we complete the quest, we should get a badge at the end or a badge notification. So coin number one is good. Spider-Man skills is good. Coin number two set. So again, running through this portal, it should end the quest and reward us with a badge. We should get a badge notification when we run through this. Boom, quest completed and badge earned. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Do give this video a thumbs up if you guys did find something useful today. And if you want to, go ahead and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss another video. See you guys soon.